Does your boss use stick method or carrot method? Most of the time, people that are moved up or are in leadership, people that use stick method, and basically that's like punishing you. They lead through fear. I had so many bosses like this and decided that I was going to be a carrot leader with horses and things they would like lead with a carrot on it. It would make the horse go wherever they want him to go. It was incentive. It was positive reinforcement. And that was the way that I wanted to do leadership. The problem with this is, when you are working in a typical system where they are using stick method and they like stick method, they will frown upon carrot method. They look at it like you are making friends, um, that you are being a doormat, that you are being problematic, um, and that you are just being kind of like a pushover, that you're not, you don't have enough, you don't have a strong air of authority about you. And that freaks people out for some reason. So I know so many people that are effectively leading through empathy that are given a ration of crap all the time because they are not using stick method, although their numbers are great. Employee retention is fabulous. The reason this is a problem is because it puts bad bosses in the hot seat. It makes them have to look inward and look at themselves and their lack of leadership skills, and then it pisses them off. You have all these higher ups that are walking around using stick method, and when you have one leader that's using carrot method and using positive reinforcement, it makes all of them look even worse. But unfortunately, there are still so many businesses and hiring managers and leaders and HR people that think that leading through empathy and using emotional intelligence to lead your people and to have like a really great bond with your team is not the right thing to do. And it's so bizarre. It is absolutely the reason I had to get out of leadership.